Hey watch people, in this video I'm going to kind of just show you a quick tip and trick that you can do while you're looking at uh, used Rolexes to authenticate them. This is just one tip and that is you can take a black light or black flashlight and shine it on this left corner here and I'll show you up close. If I show you, if I, you can kind of see how it illuminates on the left corner and if you look carefully it says Rolex, Rolex, Rolex uh, in that pattern there. Let me see if I can get closer. There we go. So no back, no black light. You don't. It just completely disappears. It just looks solid green there on the top left. Then you turn the black light on, and it then appears like that. Um, so that's pretty cool. I have also showed some other kind of fun stuff with the black light on my um, Pepsi GMT. So check the top right. I'll post a link to that review um, because you can also kind of check the Pepsi GMT bezel with the uh, black light as well. And then also check the description field. I'll post a link for this flashlight as well. It has a black light in it, but it also has regular LED flashlight and um, it also blinks. So it has like four different modes um, with the UV light. And I think this is under like 10 bucks, really cheap. So definitely recommend it. So yeah, just a quick way to, um, Check out uh, Rolexes if you're looking at like a used Rolex, um, just to make sure that the card at least is real. And then, ju and then just to show you, this is the back of the card as well. Now I'm actually not sure if Rolex is still using this type of card. They've actually recently, just as of a couple of months ago, come up with a brand new kind of uh, warranty card. So um, this will work with, so this tip in this video will work with this type of card, but I don't know if it works with the new type of um, cards. The new type of warranty card is a more modern looking kind of card with a different design and looks kind of more, I don't know, computerized or modern for lack of a better word. So that's just something to be aware of. Questions, comments, or feedback, please feel free to leave them and I'll see you in my next video.